My answer is that if we want to go somewhere, first we should know where we are. And I think at the moment we are not exactly sure where we are. Things are getting so confusing. So for a long time I've been working with maps and I use them to express my feelings about urban existence. Like li living in a city can be sometimes very chaotic and turbulent and you really don't know where to go, what to do, whom to meet at the same time. But also, I like to use maps to express my feelings about being lost. Like physically, when you go into a city where you have never been, you have a paper map in your hand, you have a phone in your hand, and then you come to a signpost with a third map saying with a red dot, you are here. But where? Oh, gosh. So I like to express this kind of feeling of being lost. Also, I realized during the years that this has been also an expression of finding your identity, and not only your physical place, but mentally and spiritually. Since last year was happening, the war, the climate situation, the crisis in the, of the people being jammed in the cities and having tremendous problems. I wonder if we really know where we are. And the answer is the title, As Where. So I usually work with newspaper and I cut it out, cut the maps, and then I stitch them together with machine stitching. So that's how the net part of it comes. I think it is a tool for expression. It can be paint or, or a piece of marble or or textiles or newspaper. The main thing that you are trying to express something that people can resonate on or have associations with and kind of feel a little bit with you or further.